Polygonal masonry is undoubtedly a top trump argument, along with tool mark patterning, and indeed pyramidal and other structural forms which can be found across the globe, which prove there was not only once an ocean-going ancient civilization, but a worldwide highly advanced superpower who once dominated the Earth. The proof is there for all to see. Yet en masse, how they incorporate these proofs into their critical decision-making faculties is still up for debate. Yet regardless, this proof of their past capabilities are still on display the world over, a duly awarded testament to their building prowess. Although many have attempted to explain these stones, some claiming they are of artificial or geopolymer origins, others claim they are somehow a reformed rock from a plaster of Paris type constituent of the original stone itself. Some even claim a plant was responsible. Any definitive answer as to how these stones were shaped and placed, or indeed any recreation of these claimed methods, elude us to this day. A lost technology from a now lost, yet once highly advanced ancient civilization. Cusco, which translates as the city of the Puma, holds some of the most exquisite and best-preserved polygonal masonry to be found anywhere. Home to the famous 12-sided stone, something which many are not aware of, however, is that it is also home to dozens of carvings and structures, which were intended as artistic masonry renditions of animals, one of which, namely, the puma. Academic hypothesis suggests that these creations were built by the Inca, to once form the boundary walls of an ancient temple. Yet like the countless other areas we explore here on our channel, any explanation as to how the walls were constructed, or indeed why pumas and other animals were incorporated into this enigmatic stonework, is absent from all and any academically accepted historical description of their origin. We feel that these structures were built for a reason even stretching as far as Egypt, present as casing stones on the pyramids of Egypt themselves. They wanted future man to witness this stonework, built to last and to remain immovable. It is as if they were trying to tell us something about their existence, and indeed the true history and perhaps future fate of mankind. We find Cusco's puma, and indeed the lost knowledge itself, highly compelling.